poem was a poem published by Ellen Ginsberg that really changed the face of poetry. It was a really important poem and discussed a lot of issues dealing, you know, urban issues, sexuality issues, etc. So it was chosen by the people who started Howell Festival as a symbolic way to continue poetry and art and innovative ideas in, in the art. Because the artists in the Lower East Side Meese Village usually, like, like myself, I was a musician in this area, playing in a band for 10 years, we never really received W-2s or anything like that. So this is a celebration, but Howell also has a health fund which benefits people in the arts, you know, actors, musicians, performing artists, visual artists, get services that they need. Something new I've been working on, triangles and circles. It is from my, I'm a poser. I like to pose and, um, and I perform and I, I've been making costumes. Coming to Art Around the Park since it started, I've been in every single one. I love it. It's fun. Um, and I've been doing this for 40 years. I like to take some of the American classic paintings and I'm sort of like the Change them over into a feeling that sort of represents more of me. American Gothic is pretty easy to get. I mean, when you see when it's done, it's going to be some things. That's, it shows that they're struggling farmers, you know what I mean? Because they, they're going through foreclosure and some other stuff. And I'll say that's representative of me because also I'm struggling to. I'm a machinist. I worked in a factory in the Bronx. Yeah, I mean, it's just hard, you know. I don't, I don't make a lot of money. But I decided two years ago that I would try to paint things that sort of had some kind of meaning, you know, like people would, could see it and would think about it. Uh, this began with an idea of trying to capture Obama and brooding while thinking of Martin Luther King and Malcolm X and um, the things that they've gone through in order for him to be where he's at, the fact that the world is now in a different place than when those two men were alive, and how the world sees people of color differently in both the positive and negative respects. I'm a teacher assistant full time and an aspiring artist. So, and I, um, you know, do things like this to try to get my name out there. And hopefully, in the next ten years, I will be a living, a living artist. So everything that I do, I make my money off. Of it. It's just my art. Every year, I do an interactive Howell painting. What I do is I incorporate the public into my painting, the passerby. So as they pass by, if they are willing to sit for a portrait, I draw them, and I usually every year ask a different question. So this year I'm asking people to tell me something that's hidden that you wouldn't see from the outside. Look at me is really look at me from the inside, telling a secret, an internal secret that we wouldn't normally see. An interactive painting brings the public, makes them a part of the painting, and it gives me interaction with the public, and that's the energy. That's the energy of the festival.